Well, hello and welcome to Guitar Gear Gyan with me, Sahil Jagthani, where we talk about all things related to the Indian Guitar Gear scene. And in today's episode, we're reviewing the Jackson Randy Rhodes, made in India, made in India. I love it. I love it. But before we get into that, make sure you click that subscribe button and ring that bell to stay up to date with all our latest videos. So this is the Randy Rhodes Jackson guitar with a fixed bridge version and it's crafted with quality in India. So I think this was made in the HMI factory before they shut it down. I don't know if the factory shut down or not. If the factory shut down, let me know in the comment section below. I've heard it shut down. Could be wrong. At first glances, it's beautiful. Okay, I love the contrast between the black and white. Who's that? What's that song? Black or white? Michael Jackson. Jackson. Michael Jackson. Oh my God! Black or white? My Lord Almighty! What a connection, man! What a connection! Anyway, so this could be the Michael Jackson signature guitar, but he didn't play guitar. Whatever. Anyway, so back to my 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 review. Um, looks good. Amazing features. Let me check the fret ends. No fret ends, baby. No fret ends. I love it. This is new old stock. Bought this from a guy named Selwa. Selwa from Tamil Nadu. And if you haven't seen that unboxing video, go check it out. It's probably the last kit I'll buy from him because he really packed it poorly. I was shocked that it didn't get cracked on the way because it was just basically put in a soft case and then into a box. Okay. So, Thankfully, it looks beautiful and it's not cracked. There's nothing wrong with it. And this is definitely going to be one of those wall mounted uh, guitars, you know, at the background for a long time to come. I do like the look of it and I think it's going to definitely stay on this uh, channel for a bit. Is it going to remain as is? We're going to find out. First, let me see how it sounds. Okay. Um, looks great. Feels great. Kind of struggling with the V shape to hold it in place because a lot of the effort goes when you don't have a strap, uh, you know, to hold it with your left hand. But anyway, we'll talk more about that after the playthrough. Let's get to the playthrough. Ashwin into the Pliny plugin, VST by Neural DSP, Clean Crunch, High Gain. Let's get to it. <laughs> Thank you. 
that was the playthrough. What did you think? Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Is it worth the moolah? I think these were retailing for about 26,000 bucks. You can get these online now for about 22, 23,000 rupees. Okay, worth it. Definitely worth it in my opinion. Okay, um, let me talk about the positives and the negatives. Positives are, it looks sexy. It looks super sexy, man. If you've got a strap and you play like that, ooh, man, looks nice, looks nice. Uh, if you play it like this, it's a bit of a pain, but it's still doable, but you definitely need a strap, okay, to hold it in place. Otherwise, you're gonna have uh, uh, comical mishaps happening all the time. The other problem with playing it on the lap is if you do have a strap also, the strap's gonna be like here, and then the output, luckily the output jack's positioned in such a way that it comes out from here. So it's not in the way, you know, as such. It's always out of the way. So that's a very, very good, uh, uh, you know, design feature, which I like. I love the knobs. I think they're beautiful. I love the knobs. They're not push-pull. They're not push-pull. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Not push-pull. Uh, I love the pickups. I think they sustain really well. All in all, unless I put a JB and a Jazz into this, or I put something like really high gain into this with white bobbins, I'm not going to bother to mod it. I think it's just going to be the way it is. It looks good. Feels good. Okay, um, does its job, it doesn't go out of tune so easily. Maybe I might put uh, one of those uh, fret uh, thingies, what do you call it, those fret wraps, okay? Uh, basically get your girlfriend or your wife's hairband and put it on there, so it does the same thing. But anyway, uh, one of those nice fret wraps from Dunlop or from whichever company makes them. Um, anyway, back to the review. All in all, I think fantastic, made in India, Jackson's, Randy Road, very cool. Um, I was looking to get the King V, but I'm very happy that I got this one because this one seems to sit a lot nicer on the lap also. So that's quite nice for me. Um, and yeah, all in all, nothing but good things to say about it. Um, nice craftsmanship. I'm surprised they didn't continue making these in India. I don't know why. Uh, I have nothing but good things to say about this particular model. So for me, double thumbs up.